Okay, then let's get this party started. Hi there. Can you hear me? Open your eyes. Wake up! Hey! I was having a nice nap. Oh my god, he's a pervert. <clears throat> I'm not a pervert, I'm the fairy king. having flashbacks in the third person. What a dick. Ah, fairy dust. Oh yeah, in this kind of adventure our hero is yet again a mute, which is surprising, I know, god. The music in this game has a minimalist feel to it, have you noticed that? It's like so repetitive, but it's done in such a a way that it just sounds really good. It fits in with the, with the games. Go away, moth! Stupid moths. Ah, <laughs> oh, I remember these. These are funny. Making cartoons and the little man going. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. So yeah, there's a story. Fucking, he saved the uh, world by putting everything in little orbs. And the sun's rotating. It's great. So, the only way to open it is with the stone in my hand. Why couldn't you open it, old man? It looks like the same stone you've got in your staff. But you're old, you couldn't deal with monsters, could you? You old person with his staff. So happy. Are we actually going to play the game? Newlon Village. Hey, look at that. <laughs> Me. Edit mode. Oh yeah, you can edit stuff. You can actually teleport to places as well. It makes it quicker than running. Go over here. There's the dungeon place, and you can go all the way back here, talk to this guy in this hut. See that? That was fast. It would have took like a minute to like run from one place to another. Well, not a minute, but you know, get in the house. It's a yellow submarine, have you ever so noticed that? <laughs> he lives in a yellow submarine. Man. Uh, Link! You're alive! Seems like we're the only ones in the village that survived. We'll never dream this would happen. You know what? We have to repopulate Earth. Get on the table. I mean, <clears throat> I feel so helpless. I, the mayor of the village, can't do anything about it. What am I supposed to do? I mean, <laughs> I can't speak because I'm in mute. <sighs> man. Awesome. Can you get into the cave?
Yeah, the good thing about this guy, he replenishes everything in your backpack that you have now. Look at that. Gives you water, bread, repair powder, skate powder, and an antidote drink. Now, this is really important. This is like so important that I'm just gonna whack that in there, that in there, and the repair powder on that. I kind of put it in there. Why not? What about this? Hey, talk to the guy again and. I sure hell remember that word. Oh well, just put F and back. Yeah. I could have just pressed square and yeah. So you got items, the weapons, and the attachments that you can put onto your weapons, which would be very important later on in the game, Jesus Christ. Yeah. So go into here. Spiky or yeah, prickly. Fishing bait. Fishing bait. You'll probably only see me fish once because fishing is really boring in this game, to be honest. If you like if you guys wanna see me fish then put it in the comments that you wanna see me fish. And I'll do my best to uh to see yeah, so you can fish. We we won't be able to fish for a long time, so I'm sure there was like boxes in here. Maybe later on. Anywho, let's go outside and let's go to the dungeon. Let's open it up. Yeah, let's press square to use things on things. Divine Beast Cave, the first dungeon in the whole game, and it's probably my favorite. I I don't know why. It's just I love it. Uh, it's just great. I like this dungeon. So there's basement one. There are these little green yin yang looking things. Those are the uh, things the guy put houses in and stuff. And then you've got the. Uh, the gravestone looking thing with zero, that means I've killed zero enemies. And we'll do this in the uh, next video. Sorry guys if you're expecting any uh, actual gameplay, it's just the intro just took too long, I'm afraid. Well, see you guys next, uh, next week, maybe not, maybe so. It depends if I feel like I want to make another video, maybe tomorrow or later on. I feel like a right... Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, um, goodbye!